After all, William wants to hire both of his friends and two other candidates. Now he has four people in his mind, but he does not know how he can choose the best one to fit his old position. He needs to know exactly what people can do, which he can't only base on the paperwork. He can use human resources and work trial. On Tuesday morning, William comes up with a new decision that he would reorganize his teamwork. Hello ladies and gentlemen, today I want to discuss about our new structure organization. This structure is functional structure. Here is my setup. I would divide you guys into four small groups. Each group has a new member. Group A is Jason, Group B is Garrett, Group C is Davis, and Group D is Angela. The function structure is one of the most common types because it separates the specialized knowledge of each functional area through horizontal differentiation and can direct that knowledge towards the firm's key products or services. He knows that Jason and Garrett need more training, so he decides to stand under two old members. This structure would help four new members learn something new. However, this option is just temporary because four new members must become real research assistants. Good luck, everyone. This is not enough to know who is the right person for the position. I will use the job analysis to see who is rightly qualified. What William is talking about is job analysis. Job analysis is a process that determines the scope and depth of a job and required skills, abilities, and knowledge that people need to do the job. He lists down those skills on paper. Qualities of a research analysis are discernment, math competency, trend spotting, and communicating. 